a fully equipped luxury yurt. Or a digital soccer ball. Or their own signature perfume. Oh, or a double-decker designer dog bed. Those would all be great suggestions, girls. If only my parents weren't the hardest people to shop for on the entire planet. When I say they already have one of everything, I mean it. And their 20th anniversary is tomorrow. Uh, what am I going to do? Don't worry, Sammy. We'll help you think of something. Woo! How about this personal Manny Petty robot? I mean, hello. If this doesn't scream totally unique gift, I don't know what does. I agree, Clover, which is exactly why I bought it for them last year. Whoa! What's with the noise fest? <laughs> Check it out! A stretch limo! Do you think it's a celeb in the midst of some kind of shopping emergency? Huh? Uh, something tells me it's even more important than that. Sam's right! It's not a celeb 911, it's a whoop 911! <laughs> Jerry, are you in here? Hello, spies. So lovely to see you again. Wish I could say the same, Jer. But you totally interrupted our quest to find the perfect gift for my parents' anniversary. Uh, sorry to hear that, but I assure you that I'm here on very important business. Namely, to inform you that several high-profile weddings around the globe have been attacked by unseen forces. What do you mean, attacked? See for yourself. This footage is from a wedding that took place in Italy just yesterday. Oh, no way! This is footage from the Kim Star Smashian wedding. Kim Star Smashian? Who's that? Duh! Only like the most famous socialite in the whole wide world. And the prettiest. Which isn't surprising considering she cleans her face with diamond dust. Speaking of diamonds, check out that rock on her finger. It was discovered on the moon. Which, FYI, is where she met that astronaut hottie of hers. Can you say groom-tastic? <laughs> was seriously scary. Toads! From what I could see, that dream wedding looked more like a nightmare. Indeed. And Whoop has no indication of what may have caused the disturbance. So far, it's a complete mystery. I'll tell you what else is a mystery. Why Kim Star Smashian would wear such a strange wedding dress. I mean, I know fashion, and I've never seen anything like it before. It's way avant-garde. Interesting observation, Clover. According to global shipping records, the dress came from a nondescript warehouse in the Garment District in Paris. And what about the dresses worn by the other brides, Jer? They came from the warehouse as well. It appears we have our first clue, Spies. You're to go to France and check it out right away. <gasps> oh, well, what are you waiting for? With us already? I can't send you just yet. After all, I haven't given you your gadgets. What? Yeah. Whoa! Today, we have a pair of drill heel boots, an infrared X-ray contact lens, power tweezer squeezers, and fresh on the gadget scene, an escape from trouble bubble wand. Thanks, Jerry. You're quite welcome. I've also arranged for the Whoopa Twa to be available huh? for you once you reach your destination. The Whoopa what? You'll see. Now, goodbye, girls, and good luck. <laughs> You should do something romantic for your parents' 20th, Sam. Like having their faces appear on the Eiffel Tower during the laser light show. Or you could get someone to paint their picture impressionist style and hang it in the Louvre. Uh, thanks, girls. But I got them that two years ago. <sighs> Sorry, Sammy, but the shop thon will have to wait. Looks like we're almost at the warehouse. <laughs> Good. Let's get to the mission and off the Whoopa Troll before my motion sickness gets any worse. This is it, the place where all the bride's dresses were shipped from. Sheesh, so much for putting out the welcome mat. Good thing we're spies, as in, we can let ourselves in. And the drill heel boots are just the thing to make that happen. <laughs> nice work, Alex. Is it me, or is this place not exactly rocking a fashion design vibe? You're right, Clover. It's rocking more of a dusty, smelly vibe. I don't get it. There has to be something we're missing. Well, if there is, the infrared X-ray contact lens will lead us to it. Whoa! No way! What is it, Clover? A hidden room behind that wall. Any chance there's a hidden button to go with it? 
aren't there always? Bad guy lairs are like so predictable. Oops, scratch that. That was like totally unexpected. Smelly just turned into freaky and weirdy. Tell me about it. I mean, since when are wedding gowns this high tech? No wonder Kim Star Smashian's dress looks so strange in the footage we saw. Girls, check it out. It's a list of all the wedding dresses and who ordered them. Oh, that's awesome, Sammy. And why is it awesome, exactly? Because if we can figure out where the next dress is going, we can get one step ahead of our villain, wrap this mission up, and get back to anniversary shopping. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> It says here that the last dress was shipped to the royal palace in England. The royal wedding? We've got to tell Jerry right away. Uh oh! Sounds like we tripped the alarm. We better get out of here. Uh, girls, do you recognize that sound from Professor Plunkett's class? Yeah, it sounds just like a sewing machine. Look out! Whoa! This is one wacky security system. Ladies, I know just what to do to put this rude machine in its place. Hey! Woohoo! Way to go, Sam! But hopefully your cowgirl moves work on fabric steamers as well? This is nuts! The whole place is totally rigged to attack! Temperamental equipment. At least it's not a total bust. All of the wrinkles got steamed out of my uni. <sighs> Ladies, how is the mission going? Oh, terrible! We just got attacked by the meanest sewing machine ever. Bummer. On the bright side, we think we know where our baddie's gonna strike next. The royal palace in England. Oh dear. The royal wedding is about to take place there tomorrow. You girls are to go under cover and keep an eye on this high-profile event. Yeah! Jerry, you're a genius. I mean, what better place to meet a prince than a royal wedding? <laughs> and find a wedding crashing baddie, of course. <laughs> very good. I'll add your names to the guest list. Be vigilant, as England is very near and dear to my heart. Cheerio, ladies. We're going to England! And we're on the guest list! British anniversary gifts, here we come. Okay, girls, huddle up. We need to put together fabtastic outfits that'll knock them dead at this royal wedding. Trust me, girls. They'll never know what hit them. <laughs> oh, look at that. This is so awesome. I mean, look at all the cute boys. I wonder which ones are royalty. Shouldn't they be wearing crowns or something? Hmm. Do you think maybe the bride and groom would give me one of their gifts? Because people are always getting two of something as a wedding present, right? I don't know, Sam. But right now, we need to keep our eyes peeled for our villain. We should spread out. Hmm. I agree. I'll head this way. We can keep in touch via earcom. Or the grooms. Oh, I'm with the <laughs> party. So nice to meet you. <gasps> hmm. Oh, that cake looks so scrumptiousy. Oh, no one will mind if I just take a little taste. <gasps> mm. oh, yummy. Oh, mm. <sighs> Oopsie. for a Prince Charming, not a blue plate special. Guys, I'm not seeing anything strange over here. Me neither. Mm. Yeah, 
Me either. Can't be far behind. There it is! The crazy gown we saw designs for in the warehouse. Clover's right. I'm gonna get a closer look with the infrared x-ray contact lens. I'm moving in to give you support. Ugh, the things I do for whoop. OMG! This dress is majorly decked out with hidden hostile intentions. Hey! Who's getting all gropey? Watch the threads! All right, you three. I don't know what you're up to, but you're out of here! Hmm. I'm on the guest list! And going to the royal wedding is a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity! I can't miss it! That's where you're wrong, princess. You're so gonna miss it. Look, you've got to listen to us. We think that the bride may be in a lot of danger. You have to let us out of here immediately. Hmm. For being so soft and cuddly, you sure are crabby. Oh. Oh! No way! It can't be! Well, what are you talking about, Clover? Haven't you been paying attention to fashion design class, Sam? That's Wera Van, the most famous wedding dress designer ever. So, what are you doing dressed as a guard, Miss Van? Is military chic making a comeback or something? Not exactly. Let's just say I'm here to cause some chaos. <laughs> Wait a sec. Are you the one who weaponized the bride's gown? I sure am. But why would you do such an evil thing? Because I'm tired of no one truly appreciating my work. Once these brides wear my creations, they shove them into a closet, never to be worn again! So I decided to make them the center of attention! Gowns that no one will ever forget! <laughs> okay, so I get the crazy bitter villain lady part, but do the dresses have to look so over the top? Sometimes less is more, if you know what I mean. You try loading electronic weaponry into a wedding gown and have it look good! It's not easy! We're a... Let us out of here. There's still time to stop this madness. <laughs> the madness has just huh? begun. So long, girls. I've got a wedding to crash. Party started! <laughs> <laughs> 
Totally! This royal wedding is a royal disaster! Oh. Charlie, help me! Yes, darling. I'll get help right away. <gasps> Whoa! That prince is a total wimp! Cross royalty off my dream boy wish list. So, those annoying girls managed to escape. Well, there's no escaping my dress! <laughs> this is my best dismantling of a wedding yet! <laughs> Uh-oh! Angry gown headed our way! Then it's time to bubble up with the Escape from Trouble Bubble Wand! No! No! Awesome! So, you want to play games? Fine! I can play, too. How about a little kickball? Oh, so much for escaping from trouble. Oh, tell me about it. That was more nauseating than riding on the Wupatwa. <laughs> Girls, if we want to save that bride, we gotta bust a move. Time to put that dress out of commission with a little help from this cake. My agents will take it from here and take Weera Van to the Whoop Containment Facility where she clearly belongs. Thanks, Jerry. And as much as I'd love to stay and chat about your success in defeating fashion evil, I need to gather up the wedding party ASAP so the ceremony can be finished. After all, England is counting on me and I can't let her down. Whoa. Now there's something you don't see every day. <sighs> Good thing. Seeing Jerry in action like that is way too freaky. <laughs> <laughs> yes! Quick, I need a box so I can get this delivered to my parents before their 20th anniversary is over. <laughs> oh. oh, I think today is yesterday now, Sammy. Their anniversary is huh? donezo. I can't believe it. Where did the time go? The same place it always goes. And us hopping from continent to continent, chasing around twisted baddies. Ah! Now this is a lame gift anyway. So much for finding them something unique. Hello? Sam, darling, it's Mommy and Daddy. Oh, hi, Mom. Hi, Dad. Happy anniversary. Listen, I'm sorry that I... Honey, we just wanted to thank you for the amazing anniversary gift. An amphibious bicycle tour of London? <laughs> we have never had such a unique present. Uh, d did you say bicycle tour of London? You are so good to us, baby. We're about to wrap things up, but thank you again, and we'll see you soon. Mwah. Crazy! I wonder who got them that gift? 
consider this my thank you for a mission well done, Jerry. Sweet! Sounds like Jerry really came through for you this time. I'll say, but there is no way I'm gonna blow it again next year, which is why I'm gonna start thinking about a 21st anniversary gift right now. <laughs> <sighs> 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 